have to wait to ogle with the Ouya. I'm Bridget Carey, and this is your CNET update. The video game startup Ouya has pushed back the launch date of its console system until June 25th, which is three weeks later than when it was originally supposed to ship. The Ouya is an Android-based game system for the living room that costs $99, and all games are downloadable and free to try. The company says the launch is delayed because it needs more time to meet high retail demand. And Ouya's CEO also said the company is making adjustments to improve the controller. The Ouya will be sold at Amazon, Best Buy, GameStop, and Target, but it's already been shipping devices to people who funded its original development through Kickstarter donations. Technology has enriched our lives in so many ways, and now, thanks to an invention at Huggies, babies can send a tweet when they have peed in their diapers. Yes, this is happening. Huggies Tweet Pee is a system with a sensor that attaches to the baby's diaper, and when it's time to change, the unit will alert mom and dad with a tweet, and you can retweet it to let all your followers know that your baby made a hashtag tinkle. Right now, it's only being promoted in Brazil, but perhaps someday it'll come to the U.S. so we can bless all of our followers with PP tweets. There's another great invention, this time from South Africa. A company has invented a way to deliver a beer to you by a helicopter drone. During the South African Oppie Copy Music Festival this August, the Oppie Copy Beer Drone will be loaded with beer and flown over festival goers, arriving at the GPS location of anyone who orders a cold one from the mobile app. The beer is dropped by parachute and reloaded at a nearby station. Because it's so new, it's just a promotion right now because it would be tragic to pay for a beer and have it accidentally delivered to the wrong person. In the battle of photo apps with trendy filters, Instagram won the popularity contest, leaving Hipstamatic in the dust. Even though Hipstamatic has more filters and camera effects, it's just that Instagram grew faster because it had a social component. But Hipstamatic is still hanging on, and now it's trying a new social networking tactic. Hipstamatic is launching a spin off app called Ogle for iOS, and it's trying to market itself as a network that's more than the bathroom selfie, but rather for more serious photographers that are passionate about photo art. And just like before, users can still share their photos with other networks like Facebook, Twitter, Flickr, Foursquare, and even Instagram. Photo nerds can request an invitation at ogle.com. It's free, but to get all the lens and film options, it requires a subscription of a dollar a month or ten dollars for a year. That's your tech news update. You can find more details at cnet.com/update. From our studios in New York, I'm Bridget Carey.